So today, I'll be showing you how to update your PS5 controller firmware using a PC. Now, obviously, the easiest way to update it is using a PS5. But in case you use your PS5 controller with a PC and you have no access to a PS5, then Sony made this process very, very simple. So if you go to this official Sony website, whose link I'll leave in the description below, then you should find this update wireless controller firmware page and you have instructions and a little application you can download and install on your computer so you can be able to be updating your PS5 controller firmware. Now, very simple requirements. This one works with Windows, Windows 10 or Windows 11. It's only a 10 MB file, so pretty small. And then of course you need a USB port on your computer. Something that was not mentioned here is a USB cable and you need to use a proper USB data cable to connect your PS5 controller to your PC. Now this could be a type C to type A cable or type C to type C cable in case you have a USB type C port on your computer. Anyway, so the first thing you need to do is download this application and you'll only do this the first time. So go ahead and download, click on that and then click on save. And then navigate to where it's been saved. Here it is. So go ahead and double click to install this application. Click OK. It's currently installing. And then click on Next. It's just a normal software installation on your computer. So again, read this and accept the terms and then click on next and then next again. And once you're done installing, you can click on finish at this point. Now you can close everything. So now you can go ahead and click on the start button and then search for firmware data there you go even before you finish typing you should find it there as an installed application so you can right click on this and pin it either to the taskbar or save it to the start menu whatever you want so I'll just pin it to the taskbar for easy access and from now on I should have this little icon in the taskbar alternatively you can pin it to the start menu for easy access as well so now when you go to the start menu, you should be able to find it there easily. Anyway, launch the application. And this is what the application interface looks like. Now, as you can see, I have not connected my PS5 controller to my PC. And it tells me connect your controller to your computer using the USB cable. So I'm going to do that right now. Once I connect, as you can see, it detects my PS5 controller. It says DualSense wireless controller and my firmware version is 0307. You can also see that it's charging and that's a good indication that I've connected it properly. But for firmware, you can see mine is up to date. Now, I also have a PS5, so I normally update my PS5 controller. But in case yours was not up to date, you should have a big blue button here that says update and that's what you need to click on and allow your computer to send updates to your PS5 controller. And that's basically how you can update your DualSense wireless controller using your PC. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below and good luck.